daycare is over today, friend. We need to get back to the orphanage with the other kids, like us, who don't have parents. We're the last to leave every day, but that means I get to spend more time with you. Wait, friend, do you hear that too? It sounds like someone's behind us. Do you see anyone? It's kind of suspicious. Keep an eye out, friend. Anyway, let's head through the forest where nothing bad will ever happen to us. Did you have such a great time today? Wasn't it so much fun to steal the toys from the other kids? Huh? Do you see someone close by? Oh, is that Avery? They're still trying to follow you around. Ooh, I have an idea. Let's hide in the trees and scare them when they walk past us. Where did Tyson and Frank go? I thought they went this way. Boo! Got you, Avery! Ha-ha! You, you scared me! Hey, why would you do that? That's a nice Tyson. We had to! You're being super creepy and stalking, friend, because you're their yandere. No, I'm not! Uh, hi, friend. Where are you up to? Get out of here, Avery! Friend and I need to get back to the orphanage. <laughs> Fine! I'll see you later, friend. <laughs> now that Avery's gone, we finally don't have to worry about anyone following us in the forest. Come on, let's go. Uh, friend, do you hear that? What's that noise? Ah, it's a mutant zombie and it's after us. Keep going, friend. I've got this TNT and I'll save you and blow up the big scary zombie. Yeah, prepare to be destroyed, zombie. Ah, oh, no, ah, it's getting me. Friend, help, no. Dr. L, we need to help this poor child. Of course, this is a very dangerous creature. Show that zombie what we're made of. We got this. It's finally dead. Nice job, Luna. Are you okay, little one? Did it hurt you? Oh, where are your parents? <gasps> Wait, you don't have parents. Dr. maybe we can adopt them. That's a great idea. Our child would love a sibling. What do you think of that, friend? How about we adopt you into our little family? You won't have to be alone anymore. Friend, I heard you were in trouble and ran over to help. Mom, Dad, what are you doing here? Avery, we have a surprise for you. Friend is going to be your new sibling. What? No, this isn't okay. They can't be my sibling because I already love them. No, th this isn't good at all. Ah, uh, you love your sibling already, don't you, Avery? Oh. What's on that tree, friend? Oh, no, don't worry about it. There's nothing to see here. I'm just gonna remove this and we'll be on our way. You don't want to ruin the trees. Yes, it's very important to conserve the trees. If everyone is ready, let's take friend to their new home. Aren't you excited, friend? This doesn't feel right, friend. I want to be with you, but not like this. You can't be my sibling. <laughs> We're finally here, friend. Come take a look at your new home. Isn't it fantastic? I'm sure you'll love being able to grow up somewhere nice and safe. Do we have to adopt, friend? Yes, Avery. It's been decided by your mom and me. You'll get used to it. Friend, would you like the tour of the house before you get settled in? We've got a lot of cool stuff to show you. Okay, so to start, here's our magical enchanting area. And come on, continuing on, if you go further inside the living room, you can see our amazing yandere shrine. It should be awesome there. As you can see, Luda is my senpai, and I'm hers. Avery, we have a big surprise for you. Another surprise, Mom? <clears throat> okay, so we know you've wanted a senpai for a while, so we found someone for you! What? Ah, get me out of here! Nobody! Wait, this is my classmate, Natsu! Why did you trap him in a cage? He already has a senpai and her name is Mo, and I don't like that! Yeah, that's right! Mo is my senpai! I can't be Avery's senpai! You can't keep me here! Uh, we'll have to change that. Natsu will learn to love you, Avery. Don't worry. I'm sure, Mom and Dad. Friend, let's have this chat as siblings for just a minute. We can't let them hear us. Don't look at them. We need to talk alone. Aw, look at them. We both know that I'm your yandere, but right now you have to play along with my... Our parents. If they find out how much I love you, I don't know if they'd even believe me. I hope you're okay with this, friend, but you can't say anything. Okay. Nasu is perfect for our Avery. Oh, you're back. Let's finish up our tour. Bye, Natsu. Oh, Avery, it's great that you're sharing with friend because you'll have to share your bedroom with them. <clears throat> Here we are. 
her? Why don't you show a friend around? Well, this is my closet. Uh, never mind, there's nothing in there. What's in your closet, dear? Are you hiding something? Come on, let me see, let me see, let me see. Uh, nothing. Uh, hey, Mom, isn't it such a nice day? How about we look out the window at all the free sites? <laughs> uh, uh, sure. Why are you acting so strange today, Avery? I'm totally normal. <laughs> Psst, friend. Here, I really need you to go to my closet and remove a certain photo before my parents see it. Uh, what's going on? Get rid of that picture, even if you have to blow up the whole house. Oh, thank you, friend. Is, is there something in particular you wanted to show us outside your window or like? Yeah, you just need to look around really closely. This definitely isn't a distraction. Uh-huh, yeah, are, are you sure about that? What, what's happening? What was that sound? Oh, no, Avery, your room exploded. Oh, how did this happen? Hmm, we need to repair the problem right away. Luda, gather your resources. Don't worry, we'll fix this. Thanks, Mom and Dad. Yeah, go get those building blocks. Oh, friend, they almost saw that picture of you. They would have found out that you're my senpai. I still need to keep it a secret. Nice thinking with the TNT, though. Guys, friend, Avery, let me out, please. Help me. We can deal with Natsu later. Wait, is that a barrel outside my room? What's it doing here? Friend, look at what's inside. It seems like there's some kind of strange potion. I don't think we're supposed to have seen this. We can't tell our parents that I found it. Oh, no. Speaking of, they're coming. Act normal. Do you have everything you need? Yes, we've assembled all the supplies to fix your bedroom. Luna, let's get started. All right. You know, Dr. Well, we should really look into making another room for a friend, but I think Avery first needs to learn how to share. So, while we fix this up, why don't you two go get some sleep? Right now? You need to get your rest. A good night, kids. We'll be going on a fun family mining adventure in the morning. Come along, family. We're at the Mesa. Come on, children. Hurry up. We're almost there. Why do I have to go on this adventure, Mom and Dad? I'm so tired. <laughs> Your father and I are working on a very special experiment, and the four of us need to gather some gold in the mines. Now come inside this cave, friend, and take this diamond pickaxe. Very helpful tool for you. Mining seems easy enough. All right, kids. Don't run too far ahead, and watch out for any gold that you see. Oh, friend? You found some gold ore? <gasps> You've got a very good eye. Friend, you're great at everything you do. I love you so. I mean, you're the best sibling ever. Nothing weird going on here. <laughs> uh-huh. Anyway, keep searching for that gold, Avery. Save this area so Luna and I can find you again. We're gonna look for somewhere to set up base camp for our supplies. We'll meet up later. Be very careful. Stay safe, you two. Oh, friend, we're alone again, and we can do whatever we want now. We should still look for gold, though. Friend, it's an entire your gold block but there's a giant spider guarding it we need to kill it so we can get the gold for mom and dad i'll try beating it up with a knife and you use that pickaxe to grab the block all right let's do this friend no friend i can't kill it it's too fast we can't stay here we're running away through here friend oh no it's chasing us friend i see an exit over there go through the doorway blocking off the opening with your gold oh you just got those horse now you have to get rid of them oh at least we're safe from the spider is this a laboratory dad might know something about this place because he has tons of spots for creating experiments but i don't have a very good feeling about this friend let's search around for anything interesting i wonder if this is where the potion came from luna have you seen my mutant potion it might be missing <gasps> friend it's mom and dad they're here we gotta hide well i'm sure we'll find the potion the kids are distracted so let's get to work on our plans yes that is a great idea i've already transported the test subject here is this dad's lab why are they here and not collecting gold like us perfect we're one step closer to finishing our final experiment we need somewhere else to hide they're getting closer Come on. We should check on the test subject soon. Luna, put your gold and other ores in storage so we can count how many resources we gathered. I mind quite a bit. We'll need all the gold that we can get for our testing. We're so close to the final step of our plan, but we need to make sure our new machine works. Friend, what do you think they're planning? I'm so proud of you for thinking of this amazing idea, Dr. L. I love you very, 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 very much. Anything for you and our family, Luna. I'm such a genius for coming up with this brilliant plan. Now it's time for testing. Where are they going? We need to know what they're up to, friend. If you're ready, let's jump into this portal together and go to our next destination. Ha-ha! Hey, what about us? Friend, they jumped through the portal without us. We need to follow them and see where it leads, but gotta be very careful. 
<laughs> My machine is working perfectly! Friend, point here! Natsu, you won't escape! Come on, let me out! I don't want to be here! Be quiet! Dr. O, the machine can finish the job for us! Come on! Let's relax before the final step of the plan. I got myself a new book! They have Natsu trapped here! Natsu, Natsu! Are you okay? What did they do to you? Oh no, but I don't feel so good. Okay, how do we get Natsu out of this box? Press some of these buttons and see if it'll unlock the door! Okay, press this one and uh, Oh, it just happened! Hello! Whoa! Who are you? I'm Natsu! What's up, dude? <gasps> hey, Natsu! I'm also Natsu! Oh, this isn't good! Let's get Natsu out of here! Wait, which button was it again? Oh no, Fred, just open the door! There's another one? I'm Natsu! What's up, dude? Oh, we're also Natsu! Yo, there's three of me! I guess Natsu is too distracted by himself! You two are very handsome! Thanks, bro! Oh, friend, let me read what it says! Experiment log! Two, 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 two. Aha! I have made the perfect solution to Avery's set pipe problem! And I found a perfect cloning subject! Once Luna and I capture Blink, all will be ready! Mwahaha! -ha 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 -ha. That sounds like something Dr. L would write! Natsu, what are you doing in there? Yeah, throwing a party! Wait, I'm getting claustrophobic now! Oh, oh! Get me out of here! Okay, okay, break down the walls with your pickaxe, friend! Wait, how do we know that, that you're the real Natsu and not one of the clones? Prove that it's you! I am the real me! I'm in love with Mo! Isn't that good enough? I guess. Friend, those stairs seem to be our only exit, but I saw Mom and Dad go up there too! We need to stay very quiet and not let them see us, because we're in big trouble if they find out what we know! Be careful, guys! How are you enjoying your book, Dr. L? It's lovely! Thank you so much for asking, honey! <gasps> That was under our house? Friend, we need to sneak past them and leave. Natsu, can you make a distraction? Sure. Hey, Luna, Dr. L, here I am. Natsu, how did you escape from our trap? I'm out of here. See ya. Follow me, Andre parents. Get back here, Natsu. Oh, well, Natsu's distraction really worked. Mom and Dad are going to be so busy chasing after him that they won't come back to the house and see us here. Oh, kids, what are you doing at home? Mom, Dad, Fred and I just got bored mining, so we decided to play hide and seek. I was hiding in your room, and Fred just found me. <laughs> oh, wow, Fred, you're so good at seeking. <laughs> hide and seek? If you'd like to play again, I'm the master of that game. I have so many clever hiding spots where Luna never finds me. Come on, come on. It's been a long day, hasn't it? And shouldn't you two be getting ready to sleep right about now? Oh, and friend, we're going to need you to wake up nice and early tomorrow for a big surprise. A surprise? I can't tell you what it is. Good night, kids. Friend, it's not even nighttime. Why do we have to sleep now? And what is this big surprise? They must know that we're suspicious of what they're planning. We can't run away today, so we'll make our escape in the morning before Mom and Dad come to wake us up. Mom and Dad haven't come upstairs to get us yet, so we think we have enough time to make a break for it. Our contact should be here any minute with the supplies we need for our escape. We just need to wait for a signal. Caca, caca! <laughs> wait, did you hear that? Was that a bird? I thought we were supposed to meet up with... Ow! Oh, hey, Avery! It took me a bit, but I brought extra elytras and fireworks as you requested. But I can't give them to you just yet. What? Why? Hand over the payment. Friend has a block of gold. Does that work for payment? That's perfect. Friend knows how much I love gold. Here's your elytras and the fireworks. Hopefully you guys have enough, because that's all you're getting from me. I'll see you at daycare, friend. Hey, Avery, do you have any plans for tomorrow? I'm going to be with friend. But you're not friends yonderry because you're their sibling, right? Just give me the electrotizer. Whatever. I was hoping that maybe friend wouldn't have a crazy stalker following me around anymore. What are you doing? I just want to help you, but you keep hitting me. Ah! Get out of here, Dicer. Fine. I'll see you around. Friend, we need to get to the roof so that we can find somewhere to jump off and use these elytra. Isn't it super weird that dad made a cloning machine? I mean, what do you think they were trying to capture? Friend, you've nearly made it to the roof. Can you give me some fireworks? Oh, we should go up one more level to get to the highest point of the house. It's time to make our final escape from our yandere parents. <laughs> yeah, we're flying away together. Friend, let's land on this cliff near the mountain. This seems far enough from the house. I mean, my parents probably won't see us from up here. And this means we don't have to be siblings anymore, right? Friend, let's look this way for somewhere to hide, just in case mom and dad notice we're gone and try to look for us. <laughs> that sounds like... Oh no, mom and dad are 
right there, friend. <laughs> We've been waiting for you. Took you too long enough to find us here. I thought you were still in the house. What is this place? Honey, don't worry. Everything will be explained very soon. Toss the smoke grenade. A smoke grenade? Pick up friend and take them to the extra special cage. Come along, cage. What are you going to do with friend? It'll be okay, Avery. You'll understand why we have to do this. Get friend in that cage. No, friend. Mom, dad, you can't hurt them. Of course not, dear. Everything is falling right into place, Luna. Mom, dad, I've been keeping a big secret from you. I already have a senpai. I love friend, but I didn't want to tell you because you adopted them to be my new sibling. And it was really creepy to show my unconditional love for my unadopted sibling. Yes, we know friend is your senpai. It's very obvious. We created a mutant zombie to attack friend and pretended to adopt them so we could capture them. Wait, you adopted friends so they would be my senpai? Yes, and we planned to make a clone of friend so you could have the perfect version of them. A clone would never leave you, Avery. But I don't want a clone. Friend is perfect just the way they are. It's too late, Avery. Don't you want the perfect senpai? Join us. And we'll be a yandere family again! Join us! Join us, Avery! I love friends so much! I can't lose them! Okay, Mom and Dad, you can clone them. <laughs> yes! Prepare to be cloned, friend! Three, two, one! <laughs> You're no longer useful to us, friend! So we must sacrifice you! Friend, now that you're a clone, I get to be with you forever! Avery... I'm so glad you understand why we had to keep these secrets from you. And doesn't clone friend look wonderful in their suit? I love them so much. It's time for the sacrifice. We have your yandere, Avery, on our side, so you have no chance of escaping from us. If only you had a tool to help you break out from this cage. But guess what? You don't! Huh? You do? Friend, no! Wait, you're the real friend! Your clone doesn't have the same scent! No, no, no! I don't want a clone! Fred, I want you! You can't do this! I hate you! Oh, stop with this nonsense, Avery! You don't hate us! We're your parents! I'm here to save the day! Not to! You also brought an army of clone Nazis to help us! Yeah! yeah. We're here to protect you! Charge! Yeah! Go Nazi! Beat him up! There's so many clones of him! <laughs> Where's the real Natsu? Oh, Dr. L! Our experiment backfired on us! Friend, the only way to defeat a Yandere is to become a Yandere! Oh, friend, you're a Yandere now! <laughs> Come on, let's go beat up your stupid clone! Dr. L, you're going down! No! Dr. L, they're killing the friend clone! Oh, this is ruining everything we worked for! Friend, beat up my parents to save our love! Who won't get away with this? Hit them, friend! You're doing great! Ah! Mom is dead and dad, you're next! No, not my plans! <laughs> friend, we did it! Yeah! That was so awesome! Since you're Yandere and my parents are dead, we have to be together forever! You're officially a part of the Yandere family. Now, Natsu, could you marry friend and I? Nope. 